the same PTV. Yes, yes. Uh, your mom and boss yes. for you. I think it's uh, be in the same PTV. Yeah. Entrepreneurship uh, maybe. Uh, the same part. Yeah, you ask good questions. Yes, yes. I hope sir, you continue with your good questions. Be the first to know in same PTV. Ghana jubilates again as another good news received. Attorney General has done it again. Office of the Attorney General, Asayi Akwedim Kunim, a International Criminal Tribunal's Courts, or Asem Kesia, Yadi Ekwato Ghana. So, Yansa Kalete Nibi, Aya Pesa Yakin Kaima Yati for Insane PTV, Yanya Information. Let her know her and her office of the Attorney General and the Ministry of Justice. P.O. Box 60, Ministry of Accra. Dates 8th July 2024, I.I.A. and Ram Monday. To all press houses. And her they know was a final award in international arbitration between Amy and Wardal Gok and GNPC. Where the woman is a company is me and my friend Amy and Voltal Company Limited Ghana Limited together from Clements at the Ghana National Petroleum Corporation a core international criminal court to say Omoni and a war contracts say away a gun your oil fields. Se omo ye no omo ebe di juma ama omo boa ye ama ya exploit ye oil fields no na bu shan for the woman se another third company eba mu a Ghana for ye ji omo tu mu na eno ema e ye company Vortal and any upstreams Ghana Limited. I will the claimants in this case. A pedia kids, you know, at the call, a international tribunal. Scott said, Ghana, you know, more than any in the a say, two years ago, you treat there. I have seven billion US dollars. I feel she chromos and review in a bar nine hundred and fifty million Ghana cities. Ah, at the end of the day, in car. Interest ever sign accounts and courts, Eddie Assembly Momo and Abushan for a no and I and rather a year on the 8th of July 2024. Attorney General, Minister of Justice, Justice, Goffred Yabo Adame, a quadrine Muma or my Ghana. Nabushan for Yan Shay Lawsuit, sir, a year company no at the board Ghana, GMPC. Ose. On 8th July 2024, the International Arbitration Tribunal in the action instituted by any Ghana Exploration and Production Limited and Vital Upstream Ghana Limited, collectively called claimants, against the government of Ghana and Ghana National Petroleum Corporation issued its final award. That's it. Wabua Asem, the final award in Odiyama, Ghana. Second, or say, the tribunal dismissed the claimant's request that the tribunal declares that Ghana breached the petroleum agreement by refusing to withdraw or prevent reliance by third parties on the unitization dryer directives. Abishavo, or chilemwa, claimants no at the court say, third party na ya accepte no no. Into the oil fields business, you know. Court I refuse to claim, you know, say, and can you can say you accept it or no? I say the tribunal also dismissed the claimant's request that Ghana notify the High Court, the Court of Appeal, and Supreme Court of Ghana that the unitization directives were issued in breach of the petroleum agreements. A year uni vital company no at the Ghana Court International Arbitration Court to say Yeah yeah Ghana for 
and notify a high court and the court of appeal and subsequently the supreme court which is the apex court of ghana say a year directive sir a year gmpc and a third party company about business in the mono i breached the, the petroleum agreement now i know international tribunals are dismissed sir claims you know Young Connie told me as the tribunal found that in the circumstances on which they were issued, the unitization directives breached the petroleum agreements. That is to say, the specific unitization directives were contrary to the applicable regulations and thereby breached Article 26, Clause 2 of the petroleum agreements. The petroleum agreements, you know, Ghana Petroleum Agreements, Article 26, Clause 2 of the Constitution, you know, actually, a year unitization directives are companies, me, you know, GNPC, any uni and vital company limited agreement, you no know, more a year company you no know, edit called international tribunal as I say you are breaching that agreement you no know, no Emma a year international tribunals as you case you know, what dismisses that claim you know, so after the tribunal however affirmed Ghana's rights or authority to unitize oil fields to achieve efficient exploitations of the deposits this pays the way to unitize the Afina and then Sankofa fields or indeed any other oil fields in accordance with the procedure prescribed the courts the laws of Ghana and the relevant petroleum agreements and the attorney general Crawford Yabu Adame a contender he said in this case he said Ghana yeah and our oil fields in the area there and we own every right to decide on which companies we want to work with furthermore no, yeah, yeah, we, yeah, we have the authority as Ghana. And the tribunals know our firm and Ghana say, you have every right, say, your oil fills, such as Sankofa fills, Afena fills, any, any, any additional fills, we have the sole right to unitize all those oil fills. So, we we can achieve efficient exploitations of our oil deposits in this country. And to the tribunals, our International Criminal Court of Arbitration, our firm is a Ghana, we have every right and we have not breached any agreements whatsoever claimed by the vital companies against Ghana. The tribunal denied the claimants all claims to monetary damages or compensation. I said the claimants, I said this was subsequently revealed to 915 million U United States dollars plus interest by the end of the proceedings. This was dismissed in its entirety. Attorney General Achra, company no at the Ghana Court to say, I said you have 7 billion US dollars. And later, I will review amount to know, I call 915 million. Plus interest at the end of the day, and car international court of arbitration educates in a favor or more, and can you send the interest back out? And this are Sika else and Kagana Triano courts, international courts are dismissing Nina in its entirety. So the tribunal also dismissed in their entirety the claimants' claims against GMPC. In this are claimants. Now, I'm going to Ghana, so GMP is Ghana National Petroleum Corporation. So, tribunals are dismissing in uh, so Ghana is victorious in this case. Eight, or see, regarding allocation of fees and costs, the tribunal held that all the parties will be required to pay their own legal fees and costs. Or, Jeremiah, and I call to call a certain now, you're a charges, fees. There is a court now say, or Mosica or Medina and Canipa will be different. And I will really case, you know, against no, 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 no
tribunal has already said Ghana no as either Ghana no company now a vital company now what they are called international tribunals no. none of us will have to pay this money but uh, so obia efaneka yes obia efaneka and the ghana your portion uh, yeah, 190 000 euros because the tribunal however ordered ghana to pay 189 000 euros to the stockholm chamber of commerce being half of the, the said charges and the charges yeah yeah in care on this case you know a uh, yeah, hundred and eighty nine thousand euros instead of a uh, year billion seven billion and then nine hundred and fifteen million now nah, and kayoko kutriano attorney general so the attorney general said the attorney general has observed series of false publications by elements who were not party to the proceedings the award in respect of which was released within the premises of a confidentiality agreement executed by the parties but who are on a vile and misguided missions to cast aspersions at the government of Ghana's recent impeccable record in international arbitration proceedings since assuming office. Was it and for third parties be at the publications and in them? Abra woman named Casey Nim Ensem. Say, I am Pagana, I see a chess as he can. Now, a chairman was a regana, your records were in the international arbitration. First of all, na a case between Yenu Cote d'Ivoire on sea borders. Nina yet Muko Dim Kunim. Then we have some good deba, also M Kunim, and a way so as Yamba. And do we have good records there? And to be all this information, sir. And then, no, no, sir, or no, coffee, ya boy, dame, attorney general, at yes, he did. They should disregard all those informations. I said, the public is hereby entreated to disregard said false publications about the any Avalta award, which, within the circumstances, represents a major victory for the Republican Republic of Ghana. I say, sir, false information, sir, and then I'm saying, yeah, yes, he Victory DV said Yama any envelta company. No. You disregard it because this is a victory for the Republic of Ghana. The Attorney General remains resolute in defending the natural resources of the states and will continue to vigorously contest all international and location arbitration claims. And actions against the Republic of Ghana calculated at imposing unnecessary judgments, debts on the country. In the United States, Attorney General and the officer, and the President of the land, His Excellency Danado Adanko Akufuado, are appointed to assist him in any case regarding Ghana. Case be about the talk Ghana and the OB interim. And our state owned property, state owned companies such as GMPC. And His Excellency, and now the Constitution of Emma Ghana, who can be appointed officer, your friend, the Attorney General, our the Minister of Justice in his administration, said, Case be a better hosa or no, and it is with Jinamu Edimayan. Now, no, Attorney General. A catcher Ghana force, he remains resolute in defending the natural resources of the states. Jemua, a year, natural resources are about the at the abdomen Ghana, the gold, the oil that we have in this nation. On who will continue to be defending Ghana. Company be over rising, third party be over rising, say. Or the end at a cabby air but two years on or no Godfrey or Dame is there to contend for Ghana and to victoriously win on behalf of Ghana. It will be our energy say or this is a be so will be a better Ghana so a Brian yeah we are not attorney general office in there is there to win for Ghana and that was for this is the victory. At our deaths, our doorsteps today in Ghana. 
Attorney General has once again won a case for Ghana. In fact, to cap it all, I can affirm that this is the best Attorney General we have ever had in this country. Because gone are the days when Nanka cases be ever to Ghana any other countries in Tamua. It was always difficult for Ghana to win, but we have Attorney General, Minister of Justice, Kofret Yabu Adamia, Onim Emrai Yepa. And the case Bia Obi Ebe Rise Abe Abba Ghana son is able to win for us. And the moment you enjoy some false publications, sa false publications na and then I'm on. And there was a for a team you would dream who saying, Has the Attorney General done well or not? In fact, is he upon Ghana or not? My own who comments our comment sessions. He's fighting for Ghana. He's contending for Ghana. He's standing in for what is all and all for Ghana. So all Ghanaians, let's jubilate because this is a good news. We have a sophisticated attorney general on our land. And Kasika Chitri Dieti said, Nine billion US dollars for Anka Yaya Pediatri Yamaya Yen Zangan Anka Yukutia Ama will be. So let's see. Let's see your thoughts in this comment session. Madam Wasi.